Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hello if you're new, my name is Jeanette and I'm a licensed cosmetologist and I work at a hair salon as an assistant right now. I'm working my way up to becoming a hairdresser and this past weekend I went to Cosmoprof. I went to Royal Beauty Supply and I went to Salon Centric and I spent like a thousand dollars on hair care stuff, professional only mostly professional only hair care things and i have more things still coming on the way so that's why later in this video you're gonna see a random like complete change in how i look i have things from like i said cosmoprop royal beauty supply and salon centric and on the way i have just uh, a few things from amazon so that's the only non professional only store I went to and I went to Brighton Beauty Supply. I ordered online from them and I have more things coming from them and I had to order one thing on eBay but like I all this stuff behind me is stuff I have to show you. Not everything here is a hundred thousand dollars but with this stuff I bought from Amazon, eBay, and Brighton Beauty Supply it easily is probably around a thousand dollars so mom if you're watching I'm so sorry that I spent this much money. I know you raised me better, but I'm gonna make money back. So, um, I bought mannequin heads on Facebook Marketplace to practice on. I feel like that's the weirdest thing to ever buy on Facebook Marketplace. Like, literally, like, heads. And I had to go to a Walmart. We met halfway. And so there's this just like random girl walking over to me with a bag, like a Cheesecake Factory bag with mannequin heads in it. So I have this one which online said for haircutting and styling only. I have no idea why this can't have hair color on it, but I might do it anyway to see what happens. There was this one and one more which is downstairs because I used it and it was working on her but yeah those are the like silly things ish i guess that i bought so now let me get into everything else so i bought the brazilian blow express treatment and it came in this box it also came with a cape a brazilian blow cape but i used it and it's in my little salon that i have in my basement right now so this came with the brazilian blow express and the ionic bonding spray it came with two of the Brazilian blowout glasses because if you've ever gotten a Brazilian blowout, you know that stuff gets in your eyes and it makes you tear up like crazy. So that's why it came with the glasses. It came with a Brazilian blowout brush, a Brazilian blowout bowl, a little measuring cup, and four of these Brazilian blowout clips. And that was the first thing from Royal Beauty Supply. So I'm going to get on with the rest of the things that I purchased from Royal Beauty Supply. So I bought this Joyco Defy Damage Set. So it has a shampoo and conditioner and a protective heat shield to put on before you blow dry your hair. I use their Pro Series treatment from the Defy Damage line when I color my hair. So I figured I'll try the shampoo and conditioner as well. I bought some barrier cream for doing clients and getting so they don't get stains on their forehead. I bought these eyeglass protectors to put on clients eyeglasses so they don't get color on them. I bought this mini diva curl set with a shampoo, conditioner, a mousse and a gel and i also bought a hairspray for my mom but i already gave it to her so that is another part of my thousand dollar haul next i guess we'll go into salon centric i have two salon centric bags i have this one and i have this one over here so i'll start with the one in the back because i had to go to return one thing and then instead of just returning that one thing, I spent an extra like $150. So it would have been cheaper for me just to keep the $7 thing that I wanted to return. But you know, we live and we learn, right? You know. So I bought these Redken flash lift pods because I think it's really cool. You just like put the little pre-packaged pod into the bowl, put developer in it and it like will dissolve and boom you have lightener and i wanted to try it out so i bought that i bought this pump for goldwell um, color on developer the pink one 
Then I bought this water container and the water pump for Goldwell products. I bought 30 volume Redkin developer mainly to use on like mannequins and, and stuff because I have 10, 20, and 40. 40 I would only ever use on a mannequin but I didn't have any 30 so I wanted to buy 30 for the mannequin use. Then it's already open, but I bought a little whisk to mix up color and lightener. Then I bought this Kenra set. So it comes with a volume spray. It also comes with blow dry spray, a working spray, and a leave-in um, treatment thingy majingy. Then I bought this Goldwell 9N Appy S, very light blonde at beige silver. This is for my grandma's hair. And what I love about Goldwell and the cans is that this was $40. However, it has 8.6 ounces of color. So it'll last you a very long time and you'll easily make all your money back. And then some, instead of using a bunch of two ounce tubes of color, you have about nine ounces in a can and it's safer for the environment as well. Then I bought this foil brush. And then I bought three Colorance glazes. I bought the 5VV Max, 7RR at RR in the regular color on line and then in the gray coverage line i bought four and and i wanted to get a three and n but i don't think they make a three and n or a three n in the little pink line so i bought four instead so that was it for the first bag of things i got from salon centric so now i'm going to go into the second bag of things that i got from salon centric so that is this really heavy bag i spent like 400 dollars here which is like really like hard to hear and very hurtful to my bank account. But I'm just gonna start with what's on top. So I bought the Coloron's Lotion Pump, the blue one for the Goldwell glazes. I bought the Opalex Traveling Stylist Kit so I can incorporate Opalex treatments into the services I provide when I do hair. I bought this mixing bowl that has like the teeth here to get rid of any excess color on your brush because I've never used one of these bowls before and I think it's like cool so I wanted to try it out. I bought these um, color brushes because I thought they were pretty colors and that was like the only reason why. Then I bought another one of the Kenra Best Seller Sets. This one comes with a volume spray, a the super hold finishing spray, the medium hold finishing spray, the volume mousse, texturizing taffy, and the blow dry spray. So the only thing that was double in the two Kenra sets that I got were the blow dry sprays, but I love the blow dry sprays and I they use that at the salon I work at and I love it so much. So that isn't even a problem that I have two of them because I'm going to go through them really, really fast. I bought the Colorance Cover Plus developer. I bought the Pravana Pure Light Powder Lightener. It is a brand new lightener and I liked the idea of this one because it has blue and purple pigments in the lightener. So you just open it, pour it into the cup to measure it, but it's closed right now. And this is 24 ounces of lightener, so it's going to last a while. Then I bought the Pravana 20 volume developer. And this has 33.8 fluid ounces of developer in it. Then I bought the Fremar foils, the ones that you can cut as short or as long as you like. Because I feel like my issue when I'm doing foils is that if I have the pre-cut foils and the hair is longer than what the foil is, trying to then flip the hair up to like cover the ends if I'm not just like doing a touch up it is really hard for me because then the foil will slip and then they get the tiger stripes. So with this, I can cut them as long as I need to and less slipping, less tiger stripes. So I feel like this is an essential. And I didn't always feel that way, but as I started to practice more on the mannequins, I slowly realized that I needed foils like this. Then I bought the Colorance Cover Plus in the shade 5NN. Then I bought two cans of color for my own hair. I have 6RR at PK and 6N at RV and I will mix this with the 5RR but I already own that one so I just added these two for when I do my own hair. 
And then I bought the Pearl Pulp Riot Fireball semi-permanent color for my highlights. And then I also bought this reusable bag from Salon Centric. And that was everything that I bought from Salon Centric. So now I'm going to go into what I bought from Cosmoprof. So when I went to Cosmoprof, I was intentionally just buying the cheapest things I could find so I could use them on my mannequin because I don't want to use really expensive things on my mannequin heads. So I bought this gallon of Pro Care 20 volumes of Oliver and I bought it to go with this two pound thing of Paul Mitchell dual purpose lightener. And then since they were the cheapest things there, I bought a bunch of Paul Mitchell Demi permanent glazes. So I bought 10 BV, I bought 10 A, 9 G, clear, and 10 PA. And then I bought the Paul Mitchell processing liquid to go with that. So that is it for everything I have already purchased or have in my possession. But like I said at the end of this video, I still have Amazon and Brian Beauty Supply. So my time, it'll be a few days and your time, it'll be like two seconds. So yeah, I'm just going to leave this for now and you'll see my face again in two seconds. So it's about a week later and I have received two packages in the mail and I have gone back to Salon Centric because I had to get just one thing and the one thing that I needed was going to be on sale today so I didn't get it but I got a few other things so I'm going to show you guys the things that I did get instead. So instead of getting the one thing that I needed I got the Kenra Silkening Gloss and I got the Kenra Clarifying Shampoo and Conditioner and I got the Opalex number no. 3 and the Opalex number no. 6 and I used these last night when I glazed my hair with the Opalex 1 and 2 so I used 1, 2, 3, and 6 and my hair feels so so soft it looks much better in person than it does like in the camera like in person it looks amazing and i feel like in camera it looks like kind of eh but yeah i purchased for brighton beauty supply and the first thing that i got was this goldwell applicator bottle the one that doesn't have the canister pump on the bottom and now i did order one with the canister on the bottom and that is the only thing that, that i don't have yet and that's going to be coming in about a week from now. And I had to buy that from eBay. And I purchased three Colorance glazes. I got 3N, 4N, and 5N. Okay, so as I was filming that like three minutes of footage, my camera died. So here I am back. And I'm pretty sure this is exactly what I was wearing. Makeup, shirt, everything. Same exact way as it was when I started filming this video. So that's fun. I promise I do change and wash my clothes. Just a quick disclaimer. So as I was saying before, I got this 20 volume pump for the Goldwell bottles and I got another one of the 20 volume Goldwell developers. And then the only things that I bought that weren't professional only, I made a few purchases from Amazon. So I'm going to show you guys now what I got from Amazon. So first I got this set of brushes and they're supposed to change from black to white when they get hot. I haven't opened them and I haven't used them. So like I don't know how good they're going to be because it was $35 for these five brushes and I know people who have spent $150 for five brushes so it's definitely going to be a hit or miss. Then I bought these duckbill clips because I have no idea where all mine go and I like them better than the butterfly clips. Then I bought six of these foil combs, three black and three red. And then I bought this binder and these client cards so you can like write their name and what you did on them and like how much they charge and then inside the binder i already put the divider tabs to divide the cards thank you guys for watching this very long video and if you're still watching at this point you should definitely subscribe to my channel because obviously i kept something was done right and you liked something about this video and there's gonna be a lot more videos like this one so you should definitely subscribe and stick around for those um like this video if you liked it comment down below what other videos you would like to see and honestly i am just still bracing myself because of how much i just spent on all of these products and things but you know what i keep telling myself it's okay it's okay it's okay it's okay but 
I'll get over it and I'll make, money, I'll make my money back. So yes, thank you guys again so much for watching this video. And I hope to see you guys very soon in my next one. Bye.